Hello yet again. Um, so finally about to test my Miller table out for the first time. Um, I just ran some water through it just as a first look and um, yep, seemed right. But the tester is with the material I suppose. Um, so the test I'm going to do is I've got this, this is all the material I have, it's not much as you can see. Um, but that's black sand, and sort of all mixed through. So I'm going to add these five pieces of gold. Um, they're really easy, you can see the size for size comparison. I've put the five cent piece in there, so they're really small bits of gold. Um, the four sort of um, those four that I'm covering now. Those um, they're sort of flatter pieces, and these other two on on this side. Those two there, um, they're sort of smaller, chunkier bits, so they'll catch the flow a bit more, I suppose. Um, so yeah, I'll add these six pieces of gold to that material there. Then I'll run it through, and um, that'll be the test. If I get six pieces of gold back at the end, all right. I'll switch it on. Okay, so this is what it looks like when it's running. There a few bubbles coming down. Um, can't seem to stop that at the moment, but it probably seems to be a massive issue, so let's see how that goes. Um, yeah, the real test is Start adding material to it. So um, do that. That's good. Already, you can see that piece of gold there. Slightly moving. So I might need to raise the end up a bit. Alright, I'll raise the end up a bit. So I'll lower it down on the screw and then I'll turn it again. Alright, so I slightly adjusted it. And let's do another scoop. See what you get. Piece of gold has shown up there. Oh, another one there. Three. I think I may have lost one before. Before I adjusted it. I think I need a better brush. Oh, there we go, I've lost a piece. Lost another piece. Lost another piece. Alright, test isn't going so well. Leave it with me and I'll adjust it further. Okay, I have to get even more adjustments. There it goes. This end bit seems to be working pretty well though, without just drifting the water straight down, straight off the edge. Mm. Anyway, I'll add a bit more material. Okay, that seems to be going a bit slower now. That sets a bit better. And I'll try getting this piece of gold. Alright, oh, I got one in the jar. Looks like that's finally got to the sweet spot now.
seems to be slowly doing its thing. Seems to be pretty close now. Probably even go slightly less angle. Okay, I've backed for more. I've got all the material out of the cardboard, most of it, hopefully all the gold in there. Um, and now I'm just running it again. I've got it pretty much almost flat now, so we'll start off there. That's how I probably should have done it for square one. Um, yeah, I'll give it a crack now. I have some material, see how it goes. second piece of gold in the jar. Another piece there, that's one of the small chunky bits. Leaving it. All right, three bits of gold in the jar. Oh, there's another one. All right, that's four bits of gold in the jar. That little chunky bit there is rolling a bit, I might lower it slightly. Hmm, it's having trouble with that bit. adjustments to that. Alright, some slight adjustments to height and move the gate a little bit. See how that goes. Snuck in there. Definitely doing its thing. It's a lot slower now. 
had a lot, but I'd be a lot more confident creating material and sort of the speed. Just dump a whole bunch in there and then just let it run for a while. Yeah. So yeah, I'll let that run for a bit, a few minutes, and then I'll, we'll come back and see how much it's got rid of it. Okay, I had that bunch running for about three or four minutes now. Not as much material coming off it now. It's slowly getting rid of it though, but another piece of gold has shown up. This one really is sticking to the mat quite well, uh, sticking to the table quite well. Another one in the hole. Oop. So that's five, I think. I think there's one more to go. Um, already I've noticed that the flat piece of gold stick a lot better than the chunkier bits, they tend to roll about a bit. The last of the material, so hopefully the doll shows up in this. Oh, there it is, I can already see it. Last piece of gold, I think. In the hole, I think that's six pieces, all caught. Seems like the adjustments worked all right. Oh no, there's another piece there. That must be number six. That's a tiny little rounded piece. Seems to stick pretty well. In the hole. Pretty sure that was all six pieces. Now. So I turned off the water. Um, I'm pretty sure I got all six pieces now returned. Um, the adjustments I did that time running a lot flatter. Um, and I moved the gate up a little bit, made the gap a little larger at the bottom. All seemed to contribute to better gold retention. So I'll get the jar out. Have a look. What we got? red tape on there just to try to make sure it seals. Let's see what we have. It's six pieces of gold. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, I don't know, I would consider that a success, I think. Um, if you have any advice for me, feel free to um, post a comment or whatever. I don't know, I'm happy with it.